WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, uh, Larry Pesavento for TFNN. I wanted to bring to your attention, this is the NASDAQ. You see we made our high back here on September the 2nd. And the rally back today, folks, believe it or not, to the exact tick was 191500. And unfortunately, if you don't do it the right way, which I missed the first time, I had it just a tiny bit higher originally and uh, had an order sitting in there that uh, didn't quite get filled. But as you can see what's happening now here on the hourly, just for kicks and giggles, we'll just see if this simple thing works. So there it is right now. From the rally, you can just see what we do again. We just made another 382 off the interday rally, if that means anything, and we don't know whether it does or not. Our guest today will be Mike Moore of Moore Analytics. He's always got some great things to, to show us about the market, especially the crude oil market. And let's take a quick look at the crude because it's been under a lot of pressure here today. Shouldn't take much time to see this where we are. Here's where we are coming down and you can see we had a high up into this area right here nice little ABCD move now we're starting to come down we went a uh, little bit of a little surf and turf uh, 382 action here on the uh, the uh, October October crude oil and as we've been saying for the last few days here uh, this thing's had a lot of bearishness to the downside. Today's action, I was just pointing this out yesterday, if you remember, but today's action brought us all the way up to this level right here, and that was right on the 786, as I recall, uh, right between the two of them. And there's we've had the big move down, and so we're starting to move lower. We've already taken out this low. Highly suggestive. <clears throat> Let's try it again. Highly suggestive of making A, B, C, D uh, to the downside. So that's what we're watching here today. So uh, sorry for the voice, folks. Uh, a little bit of a Palo Verde's out here today, but uh, doing okay. Other than that, everything seems to be fine. We're going to talk about a couple of different markets here when we come back and go over some of the stock stuff. We also have some information from Robert Prechter. That will be interesting to find because he's gone into the unadulterated world of aspirin cycles. In the world of trading, 